The two proportion Z interval is used for estimating the true difference between two proportions. To find it on the TI calculator, go to stat and then over to test and then down to two proportion Z interval. Once you're there, go ahead and enter in your data. Candy Shop 1 claims to have less defects than Candy Shop 2. To test this claim, you sample 300 candies from Shop 1 and find 39 defects. 39 is the number of successes from Sample 1, and 300 is the number of samples from Sample 1. This is a sample proportion of 0.13, found by taking 39 over 300. The calculator does not ask for this, and you could be given 0.13 as the sample proportion, where you'd have to take 0.13 times 300 to find the successes in the sample. Next, from shop two, you sample 250 candies and find 50 defects. 50 is the number of successes in sample two, and 250 is the number of trials in sample two. This is a sample proportion of 0 0.20. Once again, 20% of 250 is 50 defects. The calculator wants us to enter in the number of successes, which is X. Finally, the problem wants us to create a 95% confidence interval to estimate the true difference. It's important to note that this difference is estimated by taking sample proportion one minus sample proportion two. We will get a negative difference here. We are 95% confident the true difference between store one's defects minus store's two defects is contained in the interval negative 0.1325 to negative 0 0.0075. It's important to know here that zero is not contained in the interval. Since zero is not in our interval, we have evidence of a difference and it looks like store one has fewer defects than store two.